something's going to happen when Pearl finds out you're leaving. There she is. Wait. No. No. Wait. Huh. Hello? Say goodbye. In your frickin' wetsuit in bed. Let's go back to sleep, dude. I'm telling you, something's like trying to like... I can't get to sleep. I may as well be awake. Um, if you're trying to go to sleep... Man, she's gonna like draw you into the water without a suit, dude. Wait. Come back. What happened to the coffee, dude? That's you. Isn't it? You want me to follow? Um, how about no? It's a jellyfish, dude. It's like a abyss alien jellyfish. Not a good idea. A good idea, dude. Let's go. Moon, we have to go somewhere. Of course we do. We can't just like Where are we going? It's better be a Can't goodbye. You speak to me. Where are we going? Back to the alien ship. That's where we're going. It's gonna take us down into the crush zone. Oh, there's another one over there. Okay, so dude, that should be your first hint. Not Pearl, because there's another one right there. Pearl. And another Pearl. one. That's not Pearl. Where are we going? Driving me nuts, Stan. Well, maybe you want us to like clean up the ground before we leave. I wonder how many of those we have to clean up to get Shouldn't the this uh, be someone else's job. What do you want with me? Uh oh! We just squished Pearl through the turbines. what she's doing. Yeah, see, she wants us to clean up the place before we leave. Oh, man, don't get mix- Oh, crap. Don't get mixed up between which one she is. Clean up complete. I think she's that one. Ah, man, I have the sound turned- so far down and yet it is still so loud yeah see they're going down to the crush zone are you nuts scan her 
Nothing. Mission complete. What? It's a giant octopus! Oh my god, I knew it. No, not again. I have to go home. I'm supposed to go. What do you mean not again? Home. What do you mean not again? It's leaking. Let me go. I think you're, is it leaking? Oh, we're screwed. I freaking no. told you. No, no, no. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay, shit, come. Come on now. Remember the training. Yeah, the training was stay in the habitat ring and go for home. No, no, no. Well, this is this is bad. This is bad. Yeah, it okay. is. Stay calm. Deep breaths. Come Conserve in. oxygen. Can't go up. It won't let me go. Yep, it won't let me go up. What's this? What is that? That looks like. Is there a habitat ring? A life module. Yeah. An actual. That's what I meant. See, she just there wants to stations this deep. Must have come down on a landslide or something. I can't use the... Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so I can't do that. My R doesn't... Oh, that thing's got a big old hole in it. If I can... Just push through here. Dude, this is like not a life support boat. This boat's broke, dude. what we can see. Well, there's a picture down Tim here. And that. This must have been taken. That's a big old sturgeon. Well, Dad. Might be joining you sooner than I hoped. Can't use... Briefing document. Okay, so was, I can't use my scan, so I'm not sure where I need to go, and I can't check my oxygen level. But at this point, I don't think it matters. I really don't think this is a dream. I mean, I don't think this is real. Cave. Maybe he wants me to go in the cave. Ooh, it was a big old. Um. Person? Persons? Persons? Holy shit. What is that? Uh... Are those... Rise forward. Rise forward. Keep moving. 
Yeah, what in the world? I don't know, are we going up? Where are we going? Maybe we're going up. Just up. We are not going up. It's not going to let us go up. There's a ceiling, even though there isn't a ceiling. Okay, the light is all shining right down here. On this tiny little patch of s soft sand. Oh, okay. Nope. On this dude's head. Yeah, why not? Let's just go down his throat. Fuck. Oh, God. Is that... Where the heck are we going? I mean, really, at this point... Okay, let's go out the backside. Big old rib cage. You know, we probably just swam inside of something's mouth like a big whale. whale. A whale, graveyard, an entire ecosystem centered on a single being. <laughs> Even in death, Emma, Emma told me their bodies, when they die, they release their gases. Carbon, what? <laughs> what is this place? Admiral, there'll be whales. Is this like a Star Trek Four thing now? Yeah, what creature did I just swim into their mouth? I'm down in his pit of his stomach and his acids. Hmm. Or you know, I'm of course I was dreaming. Why is there a piano playing? Dude, if we ever get out of the oceans, I am not even taking a bath again at this rate. No going back in the water. This can't... Our house. How did I... Pearl. You're... You're still... Here. Even though you led me to a giant squid. Okay, you. I think you've about worn out that armchair. Yeah, time for bed. Let's get out of here. Just put her... You know what? She's If she's just like a... glowy jellyfish... Uh, how about we just stick her in a jar and we can bring her back and put her in a fish big, tank? Huh? Up the wooden hill to Bedfordshire. Yeah. <sighs> Here we go. Daddy, I had a good day. There we go. Yep, put this one to bed. Package delivery. One sleepy girl. Put it to bed. <sighs> this one's better. done. Hmm, better. Let me close the window. Um, oh, this window. I say they work close, buddy. Under the covers now. Okay, Daddy. I'm gonna turn to a Wait, giant where's Lumiere? squid and eat my face. Daddy, I can't find Lumiere. Hey, hey, hey. Um. He can't have gone that far. Not with those little legs of his. There he is. Don't worry. I'll find him. I, I found him. Hey, Shut up. Are. Been on quite the journey together, eh? Huh. Thanks for the ride. And if, it, if this is just found like... Found him. 
all in your head to try to work out right for it letting your daughter go man you he really really find you. So really tell us a story okay. how to go dramatic about this <laughs> okay what'll it be the whale song whale song um oh there we go all right love you know what right. kind of looks like mr that. manhattan the whale song once upon a time there was a baby whale a cute calf should have sing her the roughly three tons baby from head shark. to tail His mother was a different beast entirely, over 30 meters long and 70 tons of love so motherly. The whale calf, not even close to her, worried without delay. Mummy, when you are gone, what will I become? I'm gonna get a good angle here. His for... mother would gently say, I will always be close to Maybe you. Maybe a thumbnail. There you go. It was not a terrible oh. lie to start. That's a good one too. Because our dead keep on living here. In our heart. But it wasn't fair for the baby whale. Who had seen his father died from a harpoon's travail. Oh, that sucks. That's, that's, that's traumatic right again, there. So where has Papa gone? His mother took a deep breath and replied, heads on. He is still here. His soul is swimming next to us, far and near. This is not a very good kid's book for bedtime. Then she added, I will bring you to a place without lies. A place without pretty sights. Oh my gosh, she killed her kid. Always remember this, and you will move on. On the beach, where many corpses lie. Oh my gosh. Whales in decomposition, skin dry. This is not... Regurgitated balls of plastic for pillows. Dude! Did you the really read this? got wet. And before long, tears flowed, warm and clear, his heart heavy, he started a song, sorrowful and sincere. From the baby's ache, out of the waves, a miracle happened. The air started to vibrate, the ground to shake one of the still bodies rose and widened despite the waste and the rubbish against the fragile cycle death was ascending to the sky across eternity's threshold oh, and death man, would fall man, down man, 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 man. to feed the earth Continuing a never-ending cycle in which we always find a morrow. I don't know. I'm going to assume she's around seven or eight. I don't know any eight-year-old's going to really want to listen to this. Okay, love. Time for bed. Yeah, go to bed with all that imagery in your head, darling. Daddy, please. It's, it's so cold down here. And lonely. Stay, please. Oh, God. Sweetheart. I don't know if I can. <sighs> Could I really stay? No! Emma. The baby. It's not your darling. It's not your, it's not your pearl. <laughs> Pearl's here. And you are not a water breather. Out of here. She's right here. Sorry, Pearl. I can't just leave. Yep. 
Can I? Yes. One foot in front of the other. Should I? Yep. There's a song about it. Just bye bye. Me. To me. See you, Pearl. I. Um, need her. I need. I need to open this door. That's what I. No. I have to stay. No, you don't. I won't lose my daughter. Yes, you will, because you have another daughter on the way. Probably. Not again. Probably. Adios. Sorry, Pearl. I, I, not Pearl, because there's no way you're Pearl. There's I'm no sorry, way. Sweetheart. I've. Mommy needs me. We're having a. We need each other. I love you, Daddy. <sighs> I bye bye. Miss you. I'll always miss you. Always. Time to go. Girl's gone. It's sad, but she's gone. Yeah, don't guard me with that. That's gonna hurt. Freaking ball snatcher, that's what that thing is. So what what happened? It probably wasn't a giant squid that grabbed us and broke us. We went out chasing that thing. And we we banged up our our, uh, our boat real good. We banged up our SUV. That's probably what happened. So either that's our SUV or we got another. That's just another one. Can I walk by this? I didn't think so. It's going to make us walk by the SUV. I, that one's not ours, is it? We were laying in the dirt, breathing on our tanks. Okay, yep, that one's ours. That one's pretty busted. Dude, do not... Do, do not go jumping over and looking for Pearl. Yep, time to let her go. Let, let's do a Titanic moment. And throw the, the heart of the ocean or the sea or whatever the hell it is. Throw it in there. My Pearl. I mean, I don't mean to be callous at this point, but your daughter's gone. She's been gone for over three years. You have a wife and a new one on the way. And your mind it has to be all in your mind. Your daughter's not there at the bottom of the sea here. My daughter died three years ago. Seems like hardly any time at all. And an eternity. It was her love that hurt most. It's absence. Like when she'd jump onto our bed on Saturday mornings. When Emma would sneak up behind her, lift her overhead. The house was empty without it but I still hear it every single day it's mine now and I guess that's the point life is one long series of partings but no one ever really leaves we move on knowing we carry them with us Pearl is with me now. I will love her for as long as I love anything. But for the first time in a long time, I feel... <laughs> unburdened. Free. Like I don't have to run from the future. I have to let her go. 
but I'll never leave her behind. Because none of us are alone. Not really. Pearl, I love you. And I'm doing my best to not put myself in that position. I have an eight-year-old daughter. <laughs> 